sorry I couldn't log in on time. Such terrible network. It's okay. Don't get stressed, yeah. Stressed? I'm excited. I just found out about the school excursion. Where are we going? We are going to the most colorful place in India. Wait, I'll show you. There, just see the riot of colors everywhere. From the grand murals of Bundi to the street side stalls of Pushkar, from the rich gemstones of Jaipur to the fiery lal bacha chilies of Jaipur. I need some water. Wow! Rangin Rajasthan! Yes! The people themselves are so colourful. The pagris and jutis, the odnis and lehengas, and the beautiful blue pottery, and the sparkle of kundal and minakari, and the famous miniature paintings. You know, colours make me think of Holi, my favourite festival. Oh yes! In Rajasthan, the festival of colours is also known as Thulan. Rajput men ride their horses through the spring of Gulag, and women dance the Ghumar. Red is the colour of Tej festival in monsoon. <laughs> this is called Haryali or Green Tej. And what can be more colourful than a sky full of kites on the Sankrant festival? I love flying kites too. There is the Mewar festival too. So much music and dance, and the hip in Kalbeya and their black ghagras. The Kachi Gori dance is so much fun and so are the Kalpatli Pates. I am looking forward to the festive food, you know. Ghevar, Fini, Dal Bati Churma and of course, Lal Mas, the Red Mutton Curry. Rajasthan is a carnival of colours. And even whole cities are colour coordinated. The pink city of Jaipur, blue city of Jodhpur, White city of Deepur and the golden city Jaisalmer. And I know why Jaisalmer is golden. The fort is built with yellow sandstone, which shines like gold in the sunlight. And just beyond Jaisalmer are the golden sand dunes of Thar, the great Indian desert. We can have the most exciting adventures in the Thar desert. Ride a camel, camp under the stars like the gypsies, and guess what? We can go dune bashing, a jeep safari in the Samsung dunes, raising a storm in the desert. And we can ride a hot air balloon and go sailing through the sky. That's a lot of adventure. Wait, there's more to come. From the golden sands of Thar to the green green jungles of Ranthambore, where we can actually come face to face with the most majestic tigers. You are such a nature lover, no? Well, yes. Just as you love history. Rajasthan has such a colourful history. I can go on and on about the legends and stories. Like Chittagar, the largest fort in India, where every stone tells us stories of bravery, love and sacrifice. The timeless tales of Rani Padmavati, Rama Kumbha and so many others. Oh, Padmavat, I love that story. What a great battle. Great battles were fought all over Rajputana, Kumbalgar, Mehragar and Lohagar. One can actually live in palaces and forts in Rajasthan. Yes, even now. Swimming in the cool green pool in the Umed Bhavan. Sleeping in the royal red room in the Ram Park Palace. And it is even possible to travel in a train which is just like a palace. A palace on wheels. The different courses of the train are decorated in the colours of the different parts of Rajputana. Like the Jodhpur coach is blue and gold. The Alwar coach is pale pink. And red and gold for the Bikaner coach. Oh, I just can't wait. I want to hop onto a train and go off to Rangin, Rajasthan. You have not seen so colourful a state. Plan your holiday before it's too late. Should you off Rajasthan also? Oh, so thrilling to go there, Aisha and Beck. Cactus Babu.